Incoming call handling allows you to create a professional experience for callers. You can direct calls to a specific employee or department and can create customized greetings. From the Smart PBX dashboard, click on the main number tab on the left-hand side of your screen. Then click Incoming Call Handling. There are four different timeframes you can configure for incoming calls. Open hours, lunch hours, after hours, and holidays. If you don't see the lunch hours, after hours, or holidays options, that's because you have not yet defined them in the respective dialog boxes above. Once those timeframes are defined, you'll see them as options in the incoming call handling section. Within each time frame, you will see three menu options. The first option will send calls directly to the virtual receptionist. This option is selected by default. The second option will route the call to a specified user, device, or group before forwarding the call to the virtual receptionist. The third option will send the call to a designated user, group, or device then to a designated voicemail box. For this example, we'll select option one. To configure your virtual receptionist, click on the virtual receptionist link in the box for option one. A window will pop up, which is where you will set up the configuration. For each menu item, you can assign a directory, user, call queue, media, group, advanced call flow, or device. If you want to add a greeting before your menu choices, choose from one of the options for creating that greeting shown on the right. You can choose text-to-speech, upload your own mp3 file, choose from an existing recording, or record it over the phone by following the instructions on your screen. Once your virtual receptionist is set up, click Save. When you're done setting up, your incoming call strategy for the hours you are open. Continue the same process for lunch hours, after hours, and holidays. If you don't add your preferences for those options, callers will only hear the option that you set up for open hours. When everything is set up, click Save Changes.